It's the first day of National Tourism Week and Louisiana has so many reasons to celebrate. In 2016, Louisiana tourism generated more than $3 billion in tax revenue, with nearly $2 billion of that coming in the form of state and local taxes. In Lafayette Parish alone, tourism supports nearly 10,000 jobs with total earnings of $285 million. And in Iberia Parish, another reason to celebrate. The parish is marking the 150th anniversary of the Tabasco facility on Avery Island. And as Abby Breidenbach reports, that's getting national attention. It's the tranquility, the peacefulness of it, just hearing the frogs croaking and the birds singing, the wind blowing through the leaves, the moss swaying, all of that southern stuff that everybody says about us. They need to really come experience it because it is here. Avery Island is home to hundreds of plants and animals that give it its natural beauty. That environment has helped the Tabasco Company to flourish for the last 150 years. Tabasco wouldn't be what it is if it were not for the place where it was made. And this place that we're standing right now is no more evident of that, that it truly is the flavor of this place, the flavor of our area, the flavor of Louisiana. According to Tabasco's website, Avery Island is a natural paradise, and the thousands of people from around the world who visit every year agree. It's a really special place that I think more people uh, need to know about. Samantha Brown hosts a travel show on PBS. She's in town for Tabasco's birthday and to take in the island's natural wonders. Oh my gosh, it's absolutely stunning. It is just this beautiful, peaceful, um, lovely spot in the world. It's just so peaceful. And to think of all the spice that is created here, <laughs> it's hard to believe. Brown says she's excited to see a part of South Louisiana that's not New Orleans. And tourism officials hope others will follow her lead. We like to tell people, ditch the beignets and come for the hot sauce. On Avery Island, Abby Breidenbach, KATC-TV3.